Hi, and welcome to this short Pandas data visualization tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create a histogram using Pandas. Specifically, we will learn how to plot a histogram in three simple steps. First, we of course need to import Pandas. Second, we need to load the data file. Third, we plot the histogram using the hist method. Now, before we continue, remember to subscribe to the channel and hit that thumbs up button. Oh, also, there's a link to a Jupyter notebook with the code examples, as well as a link to a blog post. Check them out in the description below. Now, that said, we are ready to start plotting the histogram. So, the first step is to import pandas as pd. Right, and the next step is to load the data. We're going to load the um, data from um, a CSV file which is stored in a subdirectory to this um, Jupyter notebook. The subdirectory is called simdata. So we will actually also import path from pathlib. Right, so the data file is in the sim data and it's called play data xls x. It's an Excel file, so we're going to use pandas read Excel method with the index call set to zero and we can see the first five rows by doing this right so now we have loaded the data and we're going to create a histogram so we will use the hist method and here we will tell them tell the hist to create a histogram of the RT variable. Column equals RT. Right. And then we get a nice histogram plotted in the Jupyter notebook. Now, if you want to group a histogram, we can type the same code, hist column equals rt and group or by by the group we can take here gender right and then we get two histograms okay that's what's the code Okay, now in this uh, Python data visualization tutorial, we learned how to plot a histogram using pandas hist method. We created one histogram and we used the by argument to create a group for two different groups by gender. Now, make sure you follow this channel because I, from time to time, put up other pandas and data analysis, data visualization with Python or R tutorials, and hit that thumbs up button. Bye.